Well, hello, Pisces. Welcome to Sin the Moon Goddess channel. We're here today to do a reading for you from November the 15th through November the 21st, 2021. We do a 10-card Celtic cross here. Sometimes they give us exactly 10. Sometimes they give us more. We just go with the flow here. Mm. All right. I think that might be it. Yes, this is it. Got 13. All right. On the bottom of the deck is the Two of Wands. We're making plans. We might even be traveling soon. All right. Before we get started, Pisces, I would like to ask you, if you haven't already, to hit that button right over there to the right and subscribe to send the, the Moon Goddess channel. That way you all know when I do the live, I will be doing one tomorrow night. All right, let's go. Let's get it. Ah, well, we are now the Princess of Swords. We have looked at our goal list, okay? And we have checked it and we make sure it's very balanced. Not only do we have our work goals, our career goals, but we have our love goals on there also. And um, our challenges, uh, it's a change. And it's a positive one. It's a good one. All right, we're going to clarify in a minute. Mm. It's a change, you're coming. <laughs> yes, indeed, Pisces. Oh, wow. Is it judgment? It is. That's your recent past. So you've already started the change. And your focus is going to be the, the last part. This is where you are now. You going you start you should start seeing a, a positive change coming along right now. Okay. And your strengths this week, ay, 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 we in our heads. Or we might be overthinking, but we also might be ending something. But we're going to clarify, okay, our future. Ah, oh, the Nine of Cups. The Divine is coming to help us, to give us happiness, okay? And our, <clears throat> our approach for the week, ah, the Ace of Swords. Our approach should, should be we're... We're the opportunity. That's we are the opportunity. We're not looking for one. We're not asking you to give us one. We are the opportunity, is what I'm hearing. And your advice of the week. Yeah, you're gonna have choices. Choices. A lot of opportunity. Yep. Yeah, see? Choices. Um, hopes and fears. Okay. Stand boldly in it. You called it, now stand up in it and be bold with it. No matter, don't. The queen of swords do not bite her tongue. Yes, she cares about others, but that's why she doesn't bite her tongue. It's because she cares about others. So she's going to allow, she's going to tell you the truth so you can cipher through everything else. Okay. Now, the outcome of the week. Wow. Okay. All right, when it comes to work, some of you guys might be traveling. Also, when it comes to work, um, things is going to look good for you. Positive. Promotion, raise, everything is looking really good. If you're looking for a job, it's looking really good. Okay? But, of course, we're clarifying everything. All right, Spirit, we have the Wheel of Fortune and our challenges. What, it, what are we Mm. Let's see. All right. All right. So, um, you know this change is here already. And your in intuition has been telling you. So, you've been holding on to your strength. And you know good things are happening. Especially when it comes to love. Okay. Some of you, hey, it, it you might be inheriting some some money of of some sort or land or something. Some of you, if you're going through a, a, a court case or like a divorce or whatever, it's going to work out for you. Okay. 
Uh, yeah, but it's love coming. If you're dealing with a, li a Libra, you guys might be moving on to the next next phase. And that's why this change and, and this, um, the will of fortune is here. Okay, the two of... Oh, the, <clears throat> Libra is here. Um, Capricorn. Water is here. Cancer, Scorpio, and Pisces. If you're dealing with another Pisces. Um... Cancer is definitely here. Uh, I said um, Capricorn, yeah. And some air is here. So we're going to throw it all in. Libra, Gemini, and Aquarius. The two of um, pentacles. Two of pentacles. Yeah, you're going through a transformation, definitely. Yeah, I think the water signs is your turn. Yeah, you're going through a transformation. <clears throat> that's why you're all up in your head. But in the future, the, the, the divine is going to help you to move through it. Yeah, they're going to help you move through it. You're having a little confliction here and there. Um, yeah, rebirth. But once you come through it, like I said, I'm hearing you saying you are the opportunity. The Ace of Swords. The Ace of Swords. Yes. Yes. Just they want you to pray and meditate because there is an opportunity when it comes to making money um, for your business. I'm hearing a lot of you um, starting a new business is going to work out just great to stick with your goals that you have worked out for you. See, those are, it's going to be so many opportunities for you. Look. It's going to be so many opportunities and choices for you to choose from. <clears throat> so just, just go with the flow. They saying to go with the flow for right now. And all of these opportunities is going to come in. Just fine tune those, those goals. Um, practice being um, um, confident, very confident and bold. And um, say, say what you feel. Say what you feel, especially when it comes to love, especially when it comes to love. They want you to get rid of the fear and the hope, hope, hopefulness. You know, you, you, you're, you, you're not, you, you're not, you don't have any hope at all when it comes to love, but they saying you should. And when it comes to, to, um, your passion and you passionate about someone. So, and you want to marry them. That's one of your goals. It's going to work out. Also, when it comes to work, your goals is going to work out. Like I was saying before, you're going to get awards when it comes to, to your goals. Okay. Some of your, you guys are going to get engaged. Some of you are going to meet your, your um, soulmate. Somebody, you know, some of you guys are very passionate passionate about someone and you guys have been fighting a, a little bit but um everything is going to be okay so just get out your head about it because um you guys are going to heal each other you've been kind of going through it because of it they want you to stick it out aquarius um cancer and um yeah double aquarius energy so <clears throat> So go go for your goals. They want you to go for your goals. This new beginning, these goals are going to get, some of them are going to get accomplished. Yeah, but they still saying you, 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 you're fighting um, within yourself, within your, within you. And you, and you're fighting like you having trust issues, Pisces, but they saying everything is cool. Everything is okay. And some of you who um, who want to have a baby, this is a good time. It's fertile time. Yeah. The divine is going to help you with that baby. And, and with this love, too. They're going to they're gonna help you get past all of these trust issues and these um, feeling sorry for yourself. Because right now, I'm hearing that's what's going on. They're going to help you um, to get rid of all of that negative talk. And self-doubt. 
so they can help you build a strong foundation. So you can have happiness. Yeah, I'm going to get rid of the fear, the doubt, the, the negative talking before this opportunity comes for work. Okay. Because they want you to have a victory. That's why they want you to be very bold. Okay. They want you to have a victory. Because it's an opportunity. Wow. It's an opportunity coming your way that you don't see coming when it concerns work. It's going to help you have balance at home. It's a great opportunity. So, um, when it comes to work. And love, they said. It's one of your wishes. It's a wish that you have concerning your career. A career wish that you're very passionate about. And if you don't, if, if you don't grab home... When the opportunity comes, if you're not ready, you're going to miss it. Yep, you're going to miss the opportunity. So you, you have to strategize now. So your, your, it's all on your goal list. See, it's on your goal list. Something that you're very passionate about. You're going to get your wish, but when the opportunity comes, you got to take it. You got to take the opportunity. And it's coming fast. This... This this wish that you have is going to come in as an opportunity. And you have to grab it when it comes. Because it's going to help your home. Help you build a, a, a stable home. It's going to free you up so you can enjoy life. Everything is fine. You just have to do what I'm... New beginning is coming your way, but when, you got to go with that opportunity. The divine is helping you. They want you to know that they're helping you. But when they help you, you know you have to help others towards energy. Because you're going through this transformation and you're being tested. Okay? So when this opportunity comes, if you don't take it, you're going to miss it. So it's going to be up to you to... It's going to be up to you to take this opportunity. You have to take it. You have to be ready for it. They saying you have you have what it takes. Stop worrying and stop feeling sorry for yourself. When the opportunity comes, the divine is going to help you. They want you to take it. Because it will work. So you're going to have choices. Not only when it comes to work, your career, but love too. So, yeah, both. It's going to be an opportunity for both. Love and career. So you're going to have to be ready. It's something that you manifest. That's what the other deck said too. So you manifest this opportunity for your career and the opportunity for your love. And now it's coming. You have to be ready. You have to be ready to accept the opportunity. Are you ready, Pisces? Look, they're asking you. <laughs> your card. Are you ready to take this opportunity or are you going to let it slip by? Well, I think that's it. They saying there's an opportunity here for you to, to take. So, all right, Pisces. I don't know what they're talking about, but they say in love and career. So... You know, so Pisces, I can't let you go without asking you to like, 
and share this video. And if you haven't already, please hit that button right over there to the right and subscribe to send the Moon Goddess channel. All right, Pisces, see you tomorrow night at the live.